Griffith from BJU Press, and I am so excited to be at the TD Convention Center in Greenville, South Carolina today. We are celebrating our customer appreciation event. During this event, I'm going to be talking with homeschool families to hear what they have to say about their experience with BJU Press Distance Learning. So keep watching. in fifth grade this year and um, I appreciate that that sometimes she has dress-up opportunities like a, a little hat that they make or um, one of my favorites was when she dressed up for Pioneer Day. Well a very funny moment for me was in my very first subject which was third grade spelling and I had a little squirrel puppet with me and I was forgetting what I was supposed to say so the little squirrel puppet started to mock me but I also had hairbrush in my hand and I use that by hitting him over the head. So that to me was a very funny moment. When I was little um, I really liked this one story, Stone Soup, and it was really fun and I did it with and I read it with Miss Walker and after that we made the soup and it was really fun. My most memorable distance learning moment was the time I fell from the ceiling. What else? Uh, you know I mean there you are hanging is supposed to be good for, I don't know, 700 pounds before it pulls apart. <clears throat> you know, it's live, what can you say? There's no safety net. So yeah, that would be number one, followed number two by the time I shocked myself accidentally with the Leiden jar, you know, put it down and, ah! It was, yeah, really uh, revolting that I did that. I, I value distance learning because I don't think I'd be able to homeschool without it because I don't have the patience or ability to teach all my children at the same time. Well, I know that my children are getting everything they need using the distance learning. And I, I like that it's bibli biblically integrated and um, that the education is sound. I think the thing that we enjoy the most or the thing I appreciate the most as a parent is the organization of it. There's no confusion about what you're supposed to do each day. Um, I'm not a trained teacher, so I don't want to have to figure out which what we're doing today or how far into the textbook we're going to get this year or what kind of extra practice we need. We follow the daily video guide and we do exactly what it says and it takes us the same amount of time it took during a normal school day and then we're done at 3.30 and there's no homework and we're done. probably Mrs. Overly. Well, I always thought she was very good at teaching English. And I liked her English classes a lot. <laughs> I liked Mrs. Walker. I hope you're excited to attend one of our customer appreciation events. Click on the link below so that you can register for an upcoming event near you. And don't forget, subscribe to the BJU Press Homeschool YouTube channel for more updates about distance learning.